broadcast live. Yo, we out here Ooh. with Javon underscore ATM. City, city. Finally yeah. made it, you know? Yeah. Jav, I mean, you're such a... I always tell you, man, you just said... You're almost like this person that's like, you don't know who he is, how to catch him, what to say. <laughs> yeah. So one of the things I did, I said, you know what? I want everyone that actually wants to know something about Java to ask questions about Java. Yeah. So I went live on the gram, Facebook, Twitter. Yeah. People sent me questions. So you know, we're gonna shout out those people and ask their questions. I'm gonna ask the people's question. I yeah. might just throw in mine, or two, mine, one or two of mine. I'm cool. But um, I'll cool. start it off that way. You know. Um, yeah. Um, firstly, the. You know the. Do you feel that you get on a, get in the studio, take your rap head, as in like your your freestyling rap head, yeah. and and put it on on songs, and that literally gives you the advantage of writing things that are so highly emotive. Yeah, I, I think uh, rapping and freestyling really shaped the type of an artist that I am today. Mm. You know because. When you're freestyling, it's all about creativity, it's all about thinking fast. Yeah, yeah. And you say, and you understand it. Yeah, yeah. You, you know, so there's, there's a lot of things that I did. I, I was telling this, 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 this other kid the other day, he said he's releasing his first song. I was like, there's no way. What, what do you mean? When did you perfect your, your skill? When, when did you find yourself? Mm, mm, mm. You know what I mean? So there's, there's a lot of things that I do that are like assignments for me, like, like, like students, mm -hmm. understand? Baba na my assignments, Baba na my exam. So there's a lot of things that I write that I'll never ever record. Mm -hmm. Understand? Mm -hmm. I just write them for me to test them on the army creativity wise because as in as it is just too complicated for the public. Yeah, 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 yeah understand? Yeah, 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 yeah. And and out of all that, and I still find um, in the language simple because I think simplicity is key. And at the same time, it's not easy. Mm. You, you, you know what I mean? <laughs> you know what I mean? So freestyling, rapping, and all of that really shaped me to what I am today. Yeah. Yeah. We always used to say, like, when we used to write, like, long, deep rhymes. Yeah. And then someone said, Balingo me commercial. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. And, and, and I think a lot of people don't appreciate that. But, like, you've kind of mastered it, you know? Um, and like the beats also, the fact that you hip hop, yeah. it just, how do you make you, how do you choose the beats? Because traditionally in Toyanzayo, normally I'm a organ, na 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 na, you know, but like, yeah. is it important for the beats to have a hip hop element in them? Yeah, at the same time, I, I really believe that choosing a beat is a skill mm. on its own. You mm. understand? Usually, you get people saying, ah, I've got a beat that I believe in Akfanel. Yeah. There's no such a thing for me. Just send the beat. <laughs> Even if, if, if it, <laughs> me now as an artist, I'll, I'll give it a meaning, I'll give it a shape, I'll give it identity, that beat. Because when you listen to a beat, here's Zita, for example, yeah. or Ukoko. Yeah, yeah. It's like it's rock and all of that, but then man get them like tak tak for over kena no koko. And then yeah. from lapo mama get me and that's when you realize okay now I'm at home. You understand? So it beats for me na. There's no such a thing as a chava beat. Mm -hmm. Understand just when you choose it beat and say what I want to say, but then at the end of the day, I believe that it means Ogmele Asi beat Lang Funali Akona, not the other way around. You understand? Yeah. You've been acting. Um, I've heard that you act, you're an actor before you actually. Yeah. I guess you. I can't say before because for me, your craft is so sharp. I'm assuming that even when you were acting, you were still trying yeah. to get out there with the music. Yeah, most definitely. I want to I remember 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 I 
I had cats coming out to battle me in the yeah. last time. Yeah. Abu Awa from Orlando. I don't know where that home is, but yeah. there's one guy that gave me a challenge because I remember. I don't think I'm going to deal because usually I would do alphabets. Yeah, yeah. It's good because I know after that, uh, there's no coming back. Dante yeah. he had his own alphabet. Yeah. You know, so I've always been doing this. The acting in the Avela, because I believe that we couldn't pull in the Funanians at that time. Mm. But among us, you always know what music has always been my thing. I'm still, I never stopped writing music. You know, I was not recording, but I was writing more almost every day. Yeah, you understand? Yeah. So it has always been my thing. And it got to a point where I felt like, hey, yes, I'm doing this acting, but it's really not my thing. I see into any timber or any really confidence in our routine. If they put 100 actors in a room and then audition us, I'm not confident enough with the Wakula yeah, But yeah. when it comes to rapping and yeah, music, yeah, yeah. I know who Thai is <laughs> about Thai. So it was yeah. one thing that I was very confident about. So I've, I've never stopped making music, the acting in tolerance of music, and I ended up leaving it, the acting for music. And obviously, everyone was against that because they thought it was over for me. Yeah. I'm too old for it, you understand? And that's when I met Umpana Futi, who rough. Mm. You understand that he, he really set me down about rapping and all of that. And now I realized, which okay, yes, I'm rapping. The raps are cool, the alphabets, but what contribution does it make in the public? You understand? And then I, and then I realized that with me singing more, I can reach more people. Mm. You understand? The manity, look, she's an anum, Kwaza, look, she's an anum, Tulum, she's. That can reach more people than a dope punchline. And even saying it in English, because Tupac's actually what life goes on. Yeah. But you see the power <laughs> of using your language, because yeah. Tupac, I'm American, only know is gloom. Yes. So when it goes, yes. life goes on, and yeah. it's, it's yo, Tupac, <laughs> I understand. Yeah, so, so decided to take that route, you yeah, understand, and, mm. and, and, and and yeah, I'm cool and then I became more matured. Mm. Until today, I've never left, even though I'm cool and in Zani, but there's still a whole lot of hip hop elements. To a point, until today, I'm on my line. Mm. Go over, over people's heads. Mm. For example, go bang and man it. Oh, mama, what's in Bonsa Bang and Bang? Can I show you your future? Yeah, and yeah, I'm yeah. talking Hendrix. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah, yeah, I'm talking yeah. about future Hendrix. Don't worry. I, I thought I think today, yeah. like, but what you do see, you mean? Mm. Sir, the cat, it, it, it just excites me because it's um, anyone singing exactly the way you're singing, yeah. they're not going to put a Hendrix song. Yeah. Yeah, I heard it, I said, oh wait, what's he? Then I heard you said it, I was like, is this guy saying future Hendrix? This shit does not mix. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. So now and then I'll throw the ad. Yeah, understand yeah. Because yeah. a lot of people believe which you only hear pop if you're going to start by saying, Yo, yeah. then rap in a certain attitude, rap in yeah. uh, deliver a in a certain way. Yeah. And then if it's not like that, it's not hip hop. Mm -hmm. then, so for me, you know, I'll always, I'll always, I'll always do that. Understand? And then, and then people understand because I want to be babus. What does that mean? Mm -hmm. Then mailing by explaining. You understand? Yeah, and, yeah. and again, it goes back to ish. If I did more of that, that means no one would actually yeah. understand what yeah, I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's um, it's it's a bad, it's a skill to have a balance, by the way. Yeah, it's, it's a skill. Yeah. It's a skill. It's a, it's it's a skill. A, I remember when you did you for and it was a freestyle, uh -huh. you know, and it goes back to what we were talking about and that freestyle. That's why at the end, I was routine routine. Tell the party, fuck it, pick me Pick put your sexy baby ring. Tell the party, bring up, bring up, booga booga. Shit, you understand me? And that whole PBS became an abbreviation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. to what I was saying, but that was not the actual plan in the eyes and Zangalela because of, I, I was freestyling, yeah, yeah, yeah. and, and it, it became one of, 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 of the most iconic verses, you understand? Yeah, and yeah, yeah. Java got cool. Zin, Java got cool. Java got cool. Tell you some keep a bunch. I understand it's yeah, yeah. Bunch in it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, I'm singing yeah. at the same time. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. raps, I understand it. It takes time to, to, to perfect your craft to that point. Mm -hmm. And I thank God every day that I took so long to to, 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 to actually be on because I don't think Instagram is what is routine. So I realized more time it takes 
the more your cup becomes better if you're not gonna focus more on these things are not going well, I'm trying so hard. Just keep going. So I was telling Andrew, just keep going. And I can see Manjo Anjo improve at Man like Man was on Ewini, the song on um Yeah. yeah. And it's, it's it's just four lines, just singing four lines. Mm. A lot of people on Facebook are like, oh, I'm not rapping. I'm yeah. like, you see, that's, that's what you guys don't understand. Yeah. It's, 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 yeah. One thing that I really appreciate about you though is that you're really about the music. Nothing else. The detail of, of the music. Yeah. You know what I mean? I want to jump into the questions on Twitter. We had O Alaji Blackanese asking if you would ever, would you ever consider doing a collab with Tandy Somerswai? Yeah, I would. I, I, I would really, I'd really love to do it. But one thing that I've realized about um, um, like about our seniors are cool. I think they don't about ten big mm. You know, they feel like you know what I mean? But but me personally I would really love to, to work with her and I hope one day is on la and and, and, and and feel like I'm ready or believe that I'm ready or I'm good enough to be to and I, by the way, I was on a music video yes, in yeah. Goma. Uh, yeah, 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 I, yeah, yeah. I don't think she remembers yeah, that. Yeah. But Maybe she does. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 she shot it in this park and she's been pulled underwater. Yeah, I remember this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So yeah, where, were, really you, where were you in the, were you it, it featured on the video or working as part of the... And I was featured on the video because yeah. my friend who, was, who shot the video was in the show. Mm was my producer at the time, we were yeah. working on it's a white guy, but he left for Ireland. Yeah. Yeah. So he was the one shooting Andy. the whole thing. Andy, Andy, Sh so no, it was Andy Sherman. Was he used to work at Wounded Buffalo. They were in Melville, but they used to do ads. Now they had a nice studio there. Yeah, yeah. The dope, very nice dope, studio. Dope, dope I think studio. I, they did wear glasses or something. Sometimes. Mm, I think, yeah, yeah, I think I remember. Yeah, yeah. and then yeah. he took me there and then I was the guy. On the music video, yeah. But yeah. I'd really love to work with, with, yeah. with her. I, I've been in her rehearsals a lot. Because mm -hmm. that's another thing that people don't know about me. We know about, about, about Steve. Mm -hmm. Steve Zoom. He used to play guitar with my little guitar. I call him Alvin. So I call him Patilis Kinsa. I can say, so I'd call to. I call him Alvin. So I'd call there and sit. I'm going to have a lot of fun. 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 All those people. So. In the corner, during that period, I feel like I'm going to get food. Ah, yeah. You understand? Yeah, yeah, These yeah. people, Bob Chabu Kanyili, you understand? The show bala, okay, always make sure it's there. Mm. You understand? In Vunulo, you, you, you know, um, there's, there's a lot that I learned, and they don't, people have to talk about it. So, now go long, because everything in my food, in, in, in my life, in my chain, mm. I apply okay, in my music. That, explains everything yeah that explains yeah. everything yeah. you literally went to a school you never paid for <laughs> yes you just you just paid with your time and yeah. your energy yeah that's what i was saying I, I used to give myself all my assignments like a student you know what i mean uh, okay it takes seven years to to become a doctor or whatever mm. now it's gonna take me 10 years to become this thing so i always had assignments uh, I, I was always learning so i'd, I'd, I'd really love to work with tennis here yeah. The, I mean, I think the lesson about that is that with even a lot of people that are following young people, yeah. they always rushing. To, yeah, they rush a lot. And uh, you know, I can't speak for the for musicians, all the musicians, but I do also feel that like um, um, you've taken so much from them, but you've also taken so much from us yeah. as hip hop. Yeah. As a culture, yeah, you're almost like the first to one of the first. Well, I don't know anyone else in the, in the back of my head, but you're probably the first because you know, I used to listen to Urino, you know, yeah, um, when I was a kid, and um, I was a rapper, you know, strictly rap, yeah, but you know. Uringo literally like allowed me to have a pickup line for a girl. Yeah. You know, so I was like, bye bye, see, tender, some, you yeah, know, yeah. and then like, they, like, they, 
they they be those things that catch you like da 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 and you the melodies mm. and it was out mm. of rap you know yeah. it was, it was yeah. really and I was like yo this shit here is 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 dope because I feel it whatever the case be you know yeah um but still it was hard for me as a rap guy for that shit to cross over to me. Oh yeah, because you know, cause yeah. I was near rap pen. Yeah, but there's those that be like, I, you know, <laughs> even if you're joining a thing though. Oh, yeah. you know what I mean? You, 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 and you listen to the the beats. You know, it's not typical mm. quite, but like it was. You know what I mean? I think it's a, it's, a, it's a rap thing because when you look at it, till today, good and cap zamis and young rappers that still believe. I want more rap. I want more rap. I want more rap. Yeah, but yeah. But rap. Drop an album, more rap because. I won't rap about now that thing which yeah, I'm yeah, a rapper yeah. and I'm yeah. not gonna sing this hook yeah. but then somehow, somehow it's not maybe cool or yeah. gangster enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah, understand? But I mean, oh, like I said, going to work and I'm out of his house, these shows, I think now Lord Mrs. Zilwood was with because I'm always in the cipher. Yeah. You understand? Yeah. So that's all I know. So mm. Angazi no boogie chairs. There's, there's, there's niggas till today who have never went to a jazz show and mm. just sit down and just and watch. watch jazz. You know what I mean? They, they always, it's, it's just hip hop. You understand? Like, they don't know anything else and they're not willing to open up to anything else. So I think it's very important to blow Moza, you know, yeah. just get out your cocoon and, and check other things. Fuck. That's dope, man. That's dope. Um, that's dope. It's just a. Uh, when I look at what rap did for me, just from a writing, from a creative, from an ear thing, but I was only, if imagine if I had opened up for everything else, I asked myself that, you know what I yeah. mean? Um, but not only were you open to it, you were, I mean, I was around Abu Sizwe Zako, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, um, uh, the, uh, yeah, Abu Zako. He actually put us in studio for the first what? time. What? Yeah. <laughs> well, you know, we were That's around crazy. them. Um, the late William Kuena, Uzu's Muzi, when you know yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I've got a funny story about Uzu's Muzi because <laughs> I don't know if you know him. I um, you know him very well. Yeah, so, yeah. Uzu's Muzi, more of a Sabom rap, and I'm telling you like three weeks ago, I put a Tapiza recorder and song, you know. And it was like, I will be something, but like, shit was whack, you know? <laughs> so, there's a studio, like, yeah. so we're young, you know, so yeah. I'm yeah. gonna rap up like, mm. like, what the hell is that doing? I'll put my studio as pair, I'll have a fun, I'll have fun, nasty, you know? <laughs> <laughs> and it literally took that act, and I was like, yeah. yo, it's some crazy shit, you know? Um, yeah. um, but yo, but I was around that, but like, yo, it talk, the balance really talks, it is it, yeah. Marco Polo and uh, Shark's essay says, what inspired this track? Is it? What inspired the track is it? Huh? Shooting a teen. Um, let me just talk about Ubungoma. Mm. You understand? Ubungoma is something that exists in our community. And it, 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 it party attracts black people. It's one of the things is, is, is a man later put my mm. Let me just say that's how it was mm. before in Gambia Sfige. You mm. understand? Mm. And I felt like no one is really appreciating Ubuntu, no one is really talking about Ubuntu, especially in the mainstream. You understand? And at the same time, Momo Momo I said, "Pass for us, no one." We want another thing. You know what I mean? We have kids, cause Ubuntu have kids. A ten-year-old told you twice to say primal. Now other kids. Would be like, oh, you a monster. Mm, oh, you understand? Mm, oh, mm, ew, what is this? Mm, that time mm, they, they see his part, yeah, you understand? Yeah, yeah. And his part, I said, no, I'm going to do his part. The same is going to be right with your mind. So it's like, ew, you understand? Yeah. And night, 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 na, the kid, Mangabona learned the answer, and then they realized, actually, this thing is a curse in my life. Mm. You understand? And, and, and then, it was like, you understand? So for me, I felt like, I want to embrace it, I want to appreciate it, and it's a dedication for me to go to work because I still have friends about no move home. We understand. So, I want to call my own team, I want to call my own team, I want to call my own So, in other words, like my success has, has, has brought enemies in my life, you understand? And I want to call my own team. 
For example, Moyo Trust, you have, you have Imbuzo, Emi, you understand, which uh, people going to look at me the same, you understand, there's my partner, but there's a lot of people that have been dumped because of my trust, with the partner be like, so it says say came to come but now it is over like Sangas. That means I'm I'm saying Zazi more which you will ban. Understand I'm not scared anymore. And um it says inclupera sangas. When I say inclupera sangas, it could be inclupero or more, I understand. It's not really iman, but at the same time. At the same time, I understand which is since I chose and accepted which okay, this is in I am. You understand? Yeah. You understand? Yeah. And why I got Ubu Kebendal to, to feature her, the Rabu go to us You understand? And I remember I sent her a picture. Mm. I was like, because we're telling you, she's one of the people I look up to and grew up listening to the soil, you know what I mean? So I sent her that picture. I sent her that picture. When I found it, I was like, I'm 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 Wafiga and and she killed it and and we must remember with me nang trust ang we no trusty so loga kuluma yo kuluma ngento futi ayazi you understand and now when you look at the messages from abantu Instagram Twitter Instagram we tell them go malia no go ma you understand they say abo ma pelatini zango ma start to agna ne aban you know what I mean so I'm really happy how it it, it came out yes. even that beat when you listen to it yeah. it's, it's some orchestra. Yeah. Energy, it's not even hip hop, yeah, yeah, but yeah. then we gave it shape. You see? So that song, that's what it talks about, and that's why I got Ubu as a feature on it. Broadcast live.